continuing on. Okay, we blew up the Presidio base, and just to reiterate my point, those APC type things never see saw them. Next to the Micron Labs, and we can make good use of this last smart bomb. You know, I've been recently feeling somewhat philosophical, and I thought I'd share some of my ponderings in this video since. Well, it just happened to be here for a good outlet. I mean, for example... Whoops. Ah, let's not get too sidetracked. I'm already low on armor. Hippie. For example... Think about the attribute of red or any color. Think about the color. Now, <coughs> I think you will find that you are not actually thinking about the color itself, but something which is of that color. I mean, it's maybe a, just some uh, surface or liquid. But you can't really think about the color itself separate from any physical objects. Yet, we all know what this color is. Well, unless you're a colorblind or blind, blind person. But I don't want to discriminate here. <clears throat> but even though we can't really define it by itself, we can operate using it validly in the real world. I mean, you show if you s see a cut it with its, its walls painted red and a ripe tomato and a drop of blood. Well, we, at least those of us who, who can observe colors, we can all say what connects them if asked. Yet, there is something beyond this everyday use, a concept which, I mean, even if you don't ascribe to platonic... Oh, and there's a red car, see? Even if you don't really subscribe to platonic philosophy yourself, I think uh, the idea of... And the, rather the concept of platonic ideas is a valid term to use when considering these things. And now let's... Alright, we blew up the henchman who was in that red car. Yeah, I shouldn't get too carried away. It'd be nice to have my... Bon my rants to have something to do with the video. And oh, now what that is left is the Alcatraz, but I thought I'd show some of the landmarks here. Uh, let's see, there's this big clock tower which I have no idea about. <coughs> and ah, uh, yeah, we get to blow up this as well. Damn, where were my shots going? That was lousy looking on to. Yeah. Isn't it interesting about concepts like that? I mean, to any attributes, and there's uh, this sort of pyramid thingy. And the actually, the same actually more or, more or less holds true to all concepts, I think. I mean, what is a table? And the, that, that one I know, I mean, this landmark, it's the Koi Tower. I mean, what's a table? How do you define a table? You start assigning it attributes, but you can come up with some something that makes it less obvious. But we all do know what a table is. All which I think is, to a certain extent, a product of our culture. I mean, if there were a culture that 
that doesn't use tables, they don't, and they don't have a word for it, they don't have a con differentiation concept for it, and so on. And, but, for example, consider numbers. Think about the number 3, instead of the color. And, well, as we take out these watchtowers, uh, you will end up thinking maybe something in a group of three, or the word three, or the, how would I say, the digit. And blow up this tower too, which looks like a rather historical landmark, but... Yeah, might be, that's the kind of thing that goes around in my head occasionally. And well... That's about all there is to this part of the mission. Now we bre break into Alcatraz. And not such a difficult mission. It was interesting. I couldn't fire my gun until I had moved. Never noticed that before. And yeah, let's see. We have the rock. Both my Malone in 1990. Yeah. Take out the sensor switch, unlock some doors, pick weapon blueprints, destroy weapon stockpiles, uh, M16X, find Agent Longhaul. And that's a really weird looking picture when you compare how he looks in the Copal Jackson screen. And I already forget, he had enemies wearing bright orange jumpsuits in the oil rig as well. I have to go back and check my own videos. Yeah. Mm -mm. Now, another thing I find fascinating is that... Well, in, how, you could call it the gap between uh, biology and specifically neuroscience and psychology. I mean you can the scientists or neuroscientists can describe the structure of nerve cells nerve cells themselves and well, the physical structure and how they combine to make the brain and other other fun stuff. But there's nobody can really say explain how exactly all this physical frame for work ends up producing a conscious mind. And oh yeah. Okay. Starting here we are on the latter half of this video already. I probably won't be being so philosophical next time. Mm, nah, not much to this mission, really. Uh, it might be one of my that one of one of the reasons I dislike these sections is that well, there's not really a whole lot of variation. Well, actually, that's not entirely true. But this and the um, oil rig are quite similar, and now we have enemy commanders are wearing black suits for some reason. Oh yeah, and you don't want them to destroy that drawing board since it had the blueprints on it. And if the board blows up, the blueprints go with it, and it's bye bye mission and there with a very low resolution it looks like the electronic arts logo or rather the old electronic art e electronics art electronic arts ah, can't speak properly electronic arts logo is on those screens and the last commanders actually appeared after destroying that sensor okay and just 
before end of ending the video just show some of these M16 X's. Now you... Oh. That's not an M16. And now you can blow them up, but also pick them up yourself, which acts as an ammo refill. And that's it for this video.